I welcome all of you on platform of your PD education and as you know you we are providing you the uh, latest updates about uh, various forms uh, which have come out uh, from various IITs and other institutes for uh, higher education in the winter admission like MS, MTech, PhD and fellowship program in management. So last update I uh, discussed with you was uh, I suppose on 19th of October. Uh, yeah, I, I think uh, 14th of October. And today, uh, 22nd of October, I'm discussing again with you the update. So let's go and see what are the new uh, forms which have come up. So first update uh, I gave you was on 9th of October. And uh, on 9th of October, the forms which had come were IIT Bombay. Last date was 26th October. Today is, uh, you see, 22nd October. So you can see if those of you who have not filled IIT Bombay, they can give, go for that. Then IIT Madras, 23rd October, IIT Roper, 26th October, IIT Gandhinagar, 2nd November, IIT Indore, 23rd October. And uh, I have also mentioned that uh, which courses are there. So uh, till for, uh, 9th of October, uh, we were only having MS in IIT Madras. Other places we were having uh, direct PhD courses. And IIMS may fellowship program in management is there, but still we have dates. And many more IIMS are still to come. As of now, because... I told you last time also like I am if you get fellowship program in management your session will start in summers not in January but summers and your interview will also be in March and all so 21st January is the last date to fill the form and uh, for other like uh, IITs admissions uh, will be I mean uh, done in January the batch will start in January itself so we can understand the last dates uh, of these particular institutes and uh, then I told you, okay, so this is uh, the same format, but here some percentage requirement, etc. were also mentioned for these kind of institutes. So eight institutes were there till uh, I gave you the uh, follow up of this. And then some more institutes were added on 14th October. That was IIT Kanpur and IIT Delhi. IIT Kanpur and IIT Delhi came with MTech MS course, IIT Delhi MS course. And you know, I tell you that IIT Kanpur is the institute which comes out with the MTech course. Many of you keep on asking, sir, where the MTech course will come? So IIT Kanpur is the institute in which it comes. In other institutes, MS courses normally come, not MTech courses, but MS courses come and PhD courses come. So that is how it was. Now this 11th number that is Rudki, Rudki direct PhD and PhD has come and last date is 29th of October. And the requirement for that is 75% for direct PhD in graduation or 7.5 CGPA and 70% or 7 CGPA for uh, I think uh, other uh, uh, branches, other cast, uh, uh, other than open caste people. So uh, IIT Roorkee is 29th. This has just uh, recently it has come. Now 22nd October, mein, these are some more additions which I want to tell you. So IIT Guwahati, direct PhD, 10th November is the last date. So those of you who have 70% plus in their BTEC, uh, they can apply for this particular course uh, that is uh, IIT Guwahati they can apply IIT Patna 75% or 8 CGPA so not every time percentage and CGPA are same it is not that you will multiply with the 10 and you will get percentage it is not that so IIT Patna has categorically mentioned that you should have 8 CGPA or 75% plus in BTEC IIT Mandi is saying 8 CGPA or 80% you see the difference so every IIT has its own criteria sometimes they say that I, triple IT Trichy has kept a very high. So those of you who have 9.5 CGPA in graduation, they can directly uh, think of applying in this. This is for MTech. Let me give you this. Uh, uh, what was this uh, heading for us? Let me tell you this. Yeah. So this is for general category and OBC economic weaker session. This is for SCST uh, is the percentage required which I am providing you. So triple IT Trichy has kept very stringent criteria, 95% or 90% uh, or 9.5%. ISC, uh, ISC ER, Education and Research, you know, they have come out uh, with a PhD and the 10th November is the last date. And Birla Institute of Technology has also come with the PhD courses. So these are the requirements for that. So now total 17. So if I can uh, maybe summarize again, total 17 institutes have come out with the forms. IIT Bombay, IIT Madras, IIT, IIT Rupert, IIT Gandhinagar, IIT Indore, then NIT Bhopal, University of Queensland, uh, uh, IIIT Delhi collaboration, I am Ahmedabad, 
uh, then IIT Kanpur, IIT Delhi, they have added IIT, IIT Rudki that I have already have mentioned, IIT Guwahati, IIT Patna, IIT Mandi, uh, Triple IIT Trichy, IIC and Birla Institute of Technology. So these are 17 institutes uh, which have come out with the PhD, MS or MTech courses and uh, more will come. I mean this entire October you can expect that uh, till mid of November the institutes will keep coming. So those of you who are interested for PhD in India, PhD in IITs and they have MTech 7.5 CGPA plus so 75 percent plus this is the time they can apply those who have this MTech courses because those who are doing MTech they cannot join because they will not be free till January this entire session will start in January but those of you who are sitting with MTech courses and want to join PhD they should apply they should go for that prepare good research proposal and uh, also uh, keep uh, uh, your uh, MTech thesis ready or BTech project ready and apply and prepare for basic concepts there will be interview and um, for PhD especially and keep preparing that nicely and I'm very sure you get the call if you meet these requirements and if you prepare well you will get converted also so there are many seats which are going to come I see Bangalore still is to come and more IITs and NITs and triple IITs are still to come we'll keep on updating you in my opinion not less than 40 50 institutes will come out with their uh, all the forms and if you apply and if you prepare well certainly you'll get selected. Thank you.